Hey, today I want to share with you my experience with Mainstay in Cary, North Carolina. Please be sure to stay tuned to the end because I will show you a full room tour, price details, bug incident, and how to request a refund. And most exciting of all, making hot pot at a hotel. Let's get started. So this is the neighborhood around the property. It's really nice, quiet, and safe. I think it's because there's a school and church nearby. It's a little hidden, so it may take a good look to find it at night time. This is the front parking lot. There's also a back parking lot, so there's a lot of space for parking. Now I'm entering the property. This is the front desk and check-in area. And then turning left is the entertainment center. It's very bright and nice here. And now we're going to our floor. Upon entering the room, you can see there's a small kitchen on the right and there's a desk and chairs, TV, um, and a queen bed. Turning here is the bathroom. It's big enough. Um, here you can see my stuff everywhere and they have a huge mirror. Um, more of my stuff. I would say this room is pretty spacious for two people. They also didn't give us a blanket so it's pretty cold at night. And this is the AC and it's working amazingly great. And this is the outside of the room. This would be the back parking lot. Okay, this side I'm not against the light, so it looks much brighter. So this is the small kitchen. Coming a little closer, you can see there is a small sink, uh, pots and pans, utensils, coffee maker, uh, stove, utensils, um, there's not a lot of stuff in it. Um, you can't expect to make fancy meals. So, yeah. And this is the dishwasher. There's also a microwave. And inside the cabinets, there's more uh, cups and plates. So this is the breakfast they had for us. I was so disappointed. And I want to use my own coffee. Now let's get our hot pot feast started. So we've got the Korean seafood soup base, fish cake, fish balls, uh, mini tofu, soft tofu, inuki, and oyster mushroom. Uh, we've got some rice noodles too. And my leftover fish from last meal. <laughs> First we'll start with putting some soup base into the boiling water and mix it well. And then add in the fish balls and fish cakes. Add some mini tofu. Mix it well. Add some inuki mushroom. Add some soft tofu. And throw in some rice noodles. Ta-da! This is the final look of it. It looks pretty good. Yummy, yummy. Leftover dish. We've actually got quite a bit of leftovers, so we made another hot pot the next day. So there is macro we got from H Mart. I really like this mini tofu. And we added some instant noodle soft tofu, oyster mushroom, well, same stuff from yesterday. Um, so this is the final look of it. It's so good. We like the meal variety for our travel, so we don't have to eat out every meal. Now it's a good time to share the price breakdown with you all. We booked this hotel through Expedia. The total price for four nights was about 342 averaging about 76 per night 
The bug incident happened on the very first night when I got to North Carolina. I found at least like 10 bucks in this room, which was so horrible. So I talked to the manager the next day and she was quick to transfer us to another room and agreed to a partial refund because we decided to stay for the rest of the night. We did think about booking somewhere else, but at this time, the hotel prices were crazy expensive. Fortunately, we didn't find any bucks in the other room. So to summarize, this hotel is kind of the you get what you pay for deal. There's only one staff managing the whole property at any time. And a lot of the amenities like the laundry room was not working and there was no fresh breakfast like I showed you earlier, which was not specified on the website. There is also quite a bit of back and forth phone calls between Expedia and the hotel to arrange the refund. Expedia had to confirm with Mainstay in order to process the refund and the manager is only at the office for a short amount of time during weekdays. It's just so frustrating and I'm just glad that it's finally done. This is only my own experience at this particular Mainstay and I hope this is helpful to you for your future travel bookings with this property. Please comment below if you have a different experience, either good or bad, to help others. If you find this video helpful, please smash that like button and subscribe for more future USA travels and cultural content. And I'll talk to you again very soon.